Bijna drie weken na het begin van de gijzelingsacties in Bovensmilde en bij de Punt besloot de regering gewapenderhand daaraan een einde te maken. They hijacked trains and took hostages. Both hijacking attempts were a disaster. And ended in the tragic loss of Dutch and Moluccan lives. These are the Moluccas, the once fabled spice islands in eastern Indonesia, my ancestral home. We're being threatened with the loss of a sense of history. My parents arrived in the Netherlands in 1951. They were in their early 20s and part of a large military contingent of 4,000 soldiers and their families, totaling about 12,500 people. Their departure from Indonesia marked their courage in an unpredictable journey of hope, despite fear and an overwhelming feeling of missing their home. The Moluccan community has grown to over 40,000. They were the first colored minority in what was then very much a lily-white country. For good reasons, my parents' generation had vehemently opposed integration. This led to the Dutch stereotyping us, not just as a troublesome ethnic group, but as complete losers. As time went on, we started to believe that and also saw ourselves as mislukkers, a wordplay on the Dutch word for Moluccans, meaning failures. The fourth generation youth have no memories of the traumatic Moluccan history in the Netherlands and thus hold no grudges against the Dutch. They no longer lament living in two worlds as we did, but take advantage of the best aspects of both enjoying the countless opportunities of modern society. They have dreams and aspirations. What's our future here going to look like? Our community and culture are undergoing momentous changes. Our cultural knowledge has been shrinking rapidly Will Moluccan folklore and music survive?